Grammy-nominated rapper Fat Joe joined the vice president for a roundtable on marijuana policy reform. It was part of a multi-state swing as the re-election effort picks up steam. Fox News correspondent Connor Hansen has more from New York. When it comes to prosecution for marijuana use, rapper Fat Joe says it's time to lean back. When the vice president calls me, I stop every day. The vice president bringing together Kentucky's governor, Andy Bashir and people who have been pardoned for marijuana convictions. Harris highlighting the administration's work on criminal justice reform more broadly. The president and I have addressed inequities through implementation of long overdue criminal justice reforms. One is we have now in recent recently announced making the Small Business Administration loans available to the previously incarcerated individuals. About half of U.S. states allow recreational marijuana use, more allow for medical use. And the Biden administration has pushed for governors to pardon state offenses. Back in 2022, Governor Bashir announced that people convicted of marijuana possession could apply for pardons. But the administration wants to see even more changes. We have directed the Department of Health and Human Services and the Department of Justice to reassess how marijuana is classified. President Biden has also brought up marijuana laws in his State of the Union address and again on the campaign trail. No one should be jailed for just using and possessing marijuana and staying on the record. Vice President Harris made several stops this week speaking on topics like reproductive rights. As November approaches, the campaign is signaling its top issues. In New York, Connor Hansen, Fox News.